Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Father, we enter your gates this morning with thanksgiving. We enter your courts with praise. We are thankful unto you, Lord God. And we do bless your name. We honor you today, Lord God. For this is the day that you have made. Hallelujah. And we will be glad and rejoice in it. Father, we thank you today that even as we arose, we arose with your presence. We arose in cooperation with your spirit. We arose with alignment to your will today. Thank you, Lord. Father, we thank you today, Lord God, that you are the author and that you are the finisher of our faith. We thank you today that he that hath begun a good work in us, hallelujah, is able to finish it and complete it unto the day of the Lord Jesus Christ. So, Father, even as we arise today, we thank you, Lord God, that worship is in our hearts, that praise is in our mouths. We thank you today, Lord God, that we are not careful, Father, to give you praise and to give you honor and to give you glory. We thank you, Father God, that even today, Lord, we approach you with the vitality of our bodies, the strength in our bodies to praise you, the strength in our bodies to honor you, the strength in our bodies to worship you. Yes, we thank you, Lord God, for we are your people and the sheep of your pasture. We thank you today, Lord God, that we've been created to worship you. We've been created to honor honor you. We've been created to praise you. We thank you, Lord, that your word declares, let everything that hath breath praise ye the Lord. Let everything that hath breath praise ye the Lord. So, Father, we thank you today that we do desire to praise you. We do desire to honor you, Lord God, with the fruit of our lips, with the activity of our limbs. We thank you today, mighty God, that because you have made this day, that for all things uh, will work together uh, for the good of those uh, that love you, Lord God, and those uh, that are called according to your purpose. Uh, we give you praise today uh, that if you allowed us to enter into this day, uh, that this day, Father God, uh, has already been created for purpose. Uh, this day, mighty God, uh, has already been created for power. This day, mighty God, uh, has already been created uh, that you would manifest your promises uh, to your sons and daughters. So we say yes, Lord. We say yes to your will for this day. We say yes to your guidance for this day. We thank you, mighty God, that your word is a lamp unto our feet and a light unto our pathways. We thank you that even as we walk today, that we walk in the steps of the Lord Jesus Christ. We thank you that your word declares to us that our steps are ordered by the Lord, that the steps of a good man are ordered by the Lord uh, and we thank you mighty God uh, that there is no one good but you uh, but because you live inside of us uh, you've commanded all things to be good uh, you've even declared to us in your word uh, that goodness and mercy uh, will follow us all the, the days of our lives uh, so Father we thank you today uh, in the name of Jesus uh, that today is a good day uh, that today is a merciful day uh, that out of your mercy mighty God uh, comes manifestations of your promises uh, out of your mercy mighty God uh, cause manifestations uh, of your restorative power your revival power your increased power in the name of Jesus uh, we thank you mighty God today uh, that this is the day Lord God uh, that you determined uh, Father God for your sons and daughters uh, to be your demonstration uh, in all the world uh, we thank you mighty God uh, that the eyes of all uh, shall see your hand on our lives today uh, in the name of Jesus uh, even as you open up the heavens uh, and you declared over your son uh, that this is my beloved son uh, in whom I'm well pleased uh, we thank you Lord God today uh, that the heavens will open uh, over your sons and your daughters uh, declaring your pleasure uh, declaring your word uh, for yea mighty God uh, you are a God that hastens his word to perform it Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. You're a God that hastens your word to perform it. You hasten your promises. You hasten your prophecies. For no man can stop one drop of your word from hitting the earth, from bringing forth in bud. No one mighty God can stop one drop of your word from hitting the target of your heart. And Father, we know today that your sons and daughters 
daughters, they are on your heart. Your sons and daughters are on your mind. Your sons and daughters are on your spirit today. That even now, our chief intercessor, Jesus Christ, sits at your right hand, ever making intercession for the saints according to your mighty will. So, Father, we thank you today that because we're on your mind, Father, no mind, no intention, no thought, no desire of your heart will go thwarted. No desire of your heart will be distracted from being accomplished in the lives of your sons and daughters. We bless you this morning, mighty God, for your word goes in the earth. Father God, like a mighty arrow of deliverance, hitting every target, hitting everything, Lord God, that you intended to do for no word you've ever spoken out of your mouth shall return unto you void but it will accomplish and prosper in the thing where to you sent it now father in the name of Jesus we thank you for divine growth today we thank you for divine development we thank you for divine acceleration we thank you for divine advancement to your purpose in our lives for yea mighty God in times past things were slow in times past things Lord God seems as though it would never pick up speed but father we thank you today that this is the day of divine acceleration this is the day of open doors this is the day Lord God where your sons and daughters enlarge the place of their tent father God that they might make room room for your glory room for your manifestation room for your power room for signs room for wonders room for miracles and yea spirit of God we decree and declare that as your sons and daughters believe the word of your mouth thank you Lord God that signs that wonders that miracles will begin to happen in their lives in their homes in the name of Jesus even as the house of Obed Edom begins to prosper because of the ark of the Lord we thank you Lord God that there is a level of supernatural growth supernatural prosperity that is happening in the home in the name of Jesus happening in the storehouses happening in the bank accounts happening in the spirits happening in the souls happening in the lives happening in the bodies in the name of Jesus because wherever Lord God wherever your presence is there is fullness of joy and pleasures forevermore so we bless you today we bless you today Lord God that it is your power it is your power that begins to demonstrate Father God the impossible things of this world it is your power for your word declares to us that it's not done by might it's not done by power but it's done by your spirit so even now mighty God we loose your spirit in our homes we loose your spirit in our minds we loose your spirit in our souls in our spirits in our bodies in our families in our relationships in our ministries yea spirit of God do what you know to do in the name of Jesus the gates are open the windows are open the doors are open we break up even the ceiling of our lives today that your mighty presence will come in the room and father we thank you Lord God that the kingdom of God uh, doesn't come from the outside. Uh, for your word declares uh, that, lo, uh, the kingdom of God is in you. Uh, now, spirit of God, uh, we thank you today uh, that you'll break out of us, uh, that you'll break for, forth in us, uh, that you'll break through us uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, for it is you, Lord God, uh, that sits at the seat of our souls. Uh, it is you, Lord God, uh, that tries the reins of our hearts. Uh, it is you, Lord God, uh, 
that we love. It is you, Lord God, that we determine to serve and the Spirit of God because we've set our affections on things above and not on things below. We thank you, Lord God, that even now we are seated with you, Lord, in heavenly places. We thank you, Spirit of God, that we rule and we super rule with you, Lord, in the name of Jesus because our lives, according to Colossians, is hid in you, God. So, Father, in the name of Jesus, we bless you today. We bless you today uh, that in the word of God, uh, we found a hiding place uh, in the word of God. Uh, we found our refuge uh, in the word of God. Uh, we found safety uh, in the word of God. Uh, we found your power uh, in the word of God. Uh, we found God got refuge. Uh, we thank you today, God, uh, that your word says to us uh, that the name of the Lord uh, is a strong tower, uh, the righteous just run in uh, and they are saved. Uh, Father, we thank you today uh, that in your name uh, has all power uh, to accomplish your will. Uh, in your name uh, has all power uh, to accomplish your intent uh, and your desire uh, for our lives. Uh, for your word declares, uh, mighty God, we thank you uh, that I know the thoughts uh, and the plans uh, that I think towards you, uh, saith the Lord. Uh, we thank you today, Lord God. God, uh, that those plans are good, uh, that those plans are perfect, uh, that those plans, uh, Father God, are of your will, uh, your will to prosper us, uh, your will to heal us, uh, your will to deliver us, uh, your will to restore us, uh, your will to revive us, uh, and because we're in your will, uh, because we're in your heart, uh, we declare in the name of Jesus uh, that no weapon uh, that has ever formed against us uh, will have the ability to prosper uh, we thank you now uh, that even now uh, you are taking the power uh, from the plots and plans uh, of the wicked one. Uh, it is powerless. Uh, it is defeated. Uh, it is conquered uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, for you are a God. Uh, you are our master. Uh, you are our Lord. Uh, you are a father. Uh, you are a shepherd. Uh, and you watch over your sheep. Uh, you watch over your sons. Uh, you watch over your daughters. Uh, you watch over your plans. You know the future. You know the destiny. You know the purpose that you place your sons and daughters in this earth realm. So, Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you today, God, that you make the way, that you go before us as Micah declares. When Micah declares that the breaker has gone before us, we give you praise, mighty God, for your spirit is like a battering ram. Your spirit, God, burst through walls. Your spirit burst through doors. Your spirit burst through every opposition, every hindrance. In the name of Jesus, we decree and declare today that this is the day of answered prayer. We thank you for phone calls. We thank you for emails. We thank you for letters in the mail. We thank you for wire transfers. We thank you, Lord God, for deposits, uh, unexpected approvals, uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, we thank you that your sons and daughters uh, find themselves uh, in a day of favor uh, that they've never seen before. Uh, for yea, Spirit of God, uh, you desire to favor us, uh, you desire to prosper us, uh, you desire to put us uh, at the head of the line. Uh, for your word declares uh, that there will come a time uh, where the first will be last uh, and the last shall be first. Father, I thank you today uh, that you are moving your sons and daughters. Uh, you're moving your sons and daughters. Uh, you're moving your sons and daughters uh, and then Messiah, uh, from the back of the line, uh, from the middle of the line. Uh, Father, I thank you today uh, that promotion doesn't come uh, from the north or the south, uh, the east or the west, uh, but promotion, mighty God, uh, promotion comes from you. Uh, it is you that puts up one uh, and sets down another. Uh, Father, promotion comes from you. Uh, now, Father God, uh, we thank you today. <laughs> that this will be the day of promotion. That you'll cause your sons and daughters 
to be favored way above their expectations way above the limitations and the restrictions of the past the present day people around them way beyond those expectations in the name of Jesus thank you Lord God that you are pushing your people forward forward into position forward into your plan forward into your promises for yea God your word declares to us that my promises they are yea and amen so we know today that your word declares that we have this confidence in you that if we know you hear us and we know you hear us then we have the petitions that we have asked you of so we say yes it's done we say yes it's done we say yes it's done it's not in progress it's not in the works it is already done and we thank you today and we say thy kingdom come on earth as it already is in heaven you told us whatever we bind on earth you would bind it in heaven and whatever we loose on earth you will loose it in heaven so around our lives today we bind your word around us like a strong rope your word is bound around us healing is bound around us life is bound around us as a garment deliverance is bound around us victory is bound around us like a mighty garment and every evil work we thank you Lord God that even as you declared to the people around Lazarus to loose him and let him go now father everything that has not been according to your plan we command it to loose your sons and daughters and let them go that they might walk in your promise that they might walk in the victory that you already have in motion it is already scheduled this earth is manifesting it now in the name of Jesus this earth is manifesting your doneness yeah this earth is manifesting your doneness in the name of Jesus now father we prophesy to every individual every situation every circumstance that you desire to use to prosper your people we prophesy to all of those things and we say get in alignment get in alignment get in alignment get in alignment in the name of Jesus get in alignment in the name of Jesus thank you Lord God that all things work together for the good of those that love you and those who are called according to your purpose well precious people thank you so much for allowing me to pray with you this morning I pray you walk in this victory I pray that breakthrough power comes out of you today in victory in advancement in acceleration in promotions in approvals thank you Lamb of God it's the Father's good pleasure to give you the kingdom Thank you so much for allowing me to pray with you. I always want you to know that when others have forgotten about your visions and others have forgotten about your dreams, I, Aaron Mobley, am praying for you.